Uh, in bath salts, there are some chemicals uh, that have not really been tested yet in, here in the U.S. or or at all for that matter um, on humans. So we don't actually know how these chemicals react on humans. Um, for the most part, we're seeing it's a uh, depending on person to person scenario. Um, different people have different uh, chemical imbalances, natural chemical imbalances. So therefore, drugs react differently to different people. Um, now they're, what they're saying is, is, you know, the, the incident in Miami was a, was a, a rare, you know, that that's like, you know, like the 1%, you know, factor, uh, of, uh, of users that will encounter something like that. The most common is, is, uh, um, heart attacks, high blood pressure, fainting, uh, you know, extreme fatigue. You know, it causes you to crash. I mean, your body can only go through so much, you know, you know, endorphins, you know, you only be rushed so much before your body crashes. But, uh, I honestly, like, I would rather, I would rather see a lot more, like, crackheads and whatnot running around on the streets than people on bath salts. Because from what I'm basically seeing and, and reading on the internet, uh, just uh, on bath salts, um... It's not just here in the U.S., it's also in other foreign countries, Canada, Australia, and Great Britain, that are now, you know, reporting, you know, having reports, basically, of people uh, doing crazy things, getting hurt, people dying. Um, I mean, to be all honest, like, other drugs have been out on the streets a lot longer. We don't hear that many reports. Um... I don't know. The, it, it seems it, it seems like an extreme, basically. Uh, it's either you're it's going to work for you, and you're going to you know apparently have like the greatest trip of your life, or it's going to kill you, or you're going to do something that will most likely kill you. Um, bath salts. I agree that that they're stupid. Uh, I agree that they should be illegal. Uh, they are supposed to be illegal, but, you know, depending on where you live, you can apparently, you can still find them and pick them up at some places. Um, but yeah, I, I mean, here it is. You, you can't, you can't go buy like Benadryl and stuff like that if you have allergies or a cold, but, uh, you can go and, you know, and get some bath salts and, you know, get seriously fucked up off of that stuff. But, uh. Yeah, I, I prefer, you know, lot to see more crackheads out on the road than to see people tweaking out on these bath salts, you know, don't need no more face munchers. <laughs>